The fire started early Sunday morning when flames broke out at the Betterly home on Mill Street in Vanderbilt. Most of the family escaped the flames, but 49-year-old Sherilyn Betterly was trapped and died in the upstairs bedroom where the fire started. It's certainly a difficult time. Not only did they lose their house, but they lost their mother, mother-in-law, and grandmother. So that's uh, a lot of grief, a lot of things to go through. Betterly was visiting her son, his wife, and the couple's two children. They all got out safely, but their clothes, furniture, and other belongings were lost. The immediate need is always to help provide shelter, and we were able to put the family up in a uh, motel room for uh, several nights. The Salvation Army and several Vanderbilt businesses have stepped up to the plate to help out. We decided to just try to help out in the community like we've always done in the past for things of this sort. The Mill Street Diner is gathering financial donations for the family and gifts for the kids. We just thought that we would help them out and try to get some people down here at the restaurant to pass out some gifts for us, you know, and we can wrap them up and hopefully the family will have a good Christmas in light of the tragedy. And these businesses hope the spirit of giving can help ease the pain that the family is experiencing this holiday season. It's, it's a difficult time for them now, and I think this is an opportune time, though, for not only the Salvation Army, but the community as a whole to come forward and, and help these people out.